When I come out that place, so I'll carry your face put there. Mm -hmm. Please, if you are not a member of the press, don't snap, otherwise I will seize your phone. You can see the 10 suspects. the command arrested in the course of investigating mm -hmm. the attack on Bundam Van, which was recorded in the state so just go ahead. precisely on the 26th of July. These are the people, and you have seen all the recoveries that were made in the course of that investigation. Eighty-four magazines of AK-47 rifle, thirteen AK-47 rifle, one GPMG general purpose machine gun, two improvised dynamite, one thousand one hundred and ninety-one ammunition of AK-47 rifle, while that of GPMG is 53 rounds of live ammunition with five cartridges and the sum of 10 million and some fractions. Investigation is still in progress. Also, by my left hand, the truck, the truck they used in the ammunition. But in my own term, I would say is their mobile, I mean their mobile armory. If you come closer, you will see the partitions great. Thank you. 
Sorry. is live here in Abia State. The Abia State Police Command parades 10 suspects. For the attack of William Van sometime last month. As you can see this is uh, some of the arms. Hello, okay. okay. Where is Mike? Mike, what are you doing back there? Bring the mic here. Bring it down. Bring it down. Okay, you are the one that drives uh, the the truck. The, the car is part of the ammunition. Okay, where are you based? I'm based in Anambra State. In Anambra State. So, at the time you were arrested, how many guns were, were, were concealed in that car? Five AK-47, one GPMG. Why did you decide to go uh, into the crime industry? Uh, I was still drop out. Uh, which school particularly? From the University of Adelkuta. I didn't have the opportunity to go to school. So, University uh, of Adelkuta? Adelkuta, right? Yes, sir. Okay, what is your name again? Machu Albert. Machu Albert. From where? Yes, sir. From where? From the King Village, I'm not trying to know, to the local government. Delta In Anambra State. State. Okay. I'm at Delta State. Okay, Delta State. Now that you have been proven guilty, what do you want the law to do to you? It's never my intention to be part of this because uh, I have a business I do legally and I try to pay back to the society. I just got involved with this so I can get expansion for my business. What kind of business do you do? I sell jeans here. Jeans here. At where? How many persons have you killed in the course of the operation so not, far? I have not shot a gun and I have not been in the operational How many times have you robbed a bank? I have not been. I have not been in the process of trying to escape. You've not killed anyone. I have not been in the My own job is just to drive the vehicle to wherever they want me to come to. 
and over the ammunition. Let's get another So please, take the format. Come here. Let's get another one. Come Prosper. Prosper. Remove your. No, no, no. Please, uh, can, can we know your name, please? My name is Prosper Chijoke. Prosper who? Chijoke. Chijoke. From where? Um, we learned uh, you were formerly of uh, the Department of uh, State Services. Is that correct? Yes, I served and I uh, was dismissed. Why were you dismissed? Why were you dismissed? Mm. I was dismissed uh, due to a long time. There was a transfer when I was serving in a government house. So after. Which government house? Abia State Government House. Okay. After I was uh, after the services after my services with my boss, then the governor Ochi Zokari, I returned to the office. I was asked to go back to the state I was transferred to. Before I could get there, I've been summary summarily uh, I've been summarily dismissed. Dismissed. You know, the middle, I tried and dismissed, dismissed in essential you know, the room. So it happened which year? This happened in 2007. So what, so then what's you your, what is your role in this uh, operation? My role is that uh, my younger brother brought money to my house. He brought money and his colleagues to my house and uh, they shared and gave me parts. So, do you ask your brother how, you know, uh, what he did and how he got the money? Yes, I did. Okay, so what did he tell you? He told me how he happened. So, what did you tell him as a law enforcement uh, officer, you know, former law enforcement officer, what, you know, should you have done? Um, the issue is that uh, now, the way the whole thing happened, I want to be with the society to help us. Some of us did not intentionally choose to. But since it has happened this way, I'm having a little regret. Therefore, asking for the society to forgive us. Okay, now let me come in. Uh, you are telling us you are sorry, but actually you, you participated in the operation, right? But you are sorry for what happened. Sir. I said you are asking for forgiveness, but actually you did participate in the operation, right? My participation is obvious. Okay. Because uh, I can't say that I did not participate since I could not rebuke my brother from sharing money in the house. Okay. That means I participated. So, so for you know, how long do you know that your brother is into crime? Yes, I knew. So for how long have you been part of uh, a deal like this? This is my first time. Okay, your first time. Okay. This is okay. So we are going to you can remove your belts. You can remove your ankles.